and I'm gonna go ahead and chop the handlebars. This is what we took out of the bike. So, okay, so this is the end result. This looks pretty bad. Okay, so in this video, I'm gonna teach you how to turn your dropped handlebars into bullhorn handlebars. So basically, how to go from this to this. We're gonna go ahead and remove the handlebar tape. We do the same for the other side. Okay, so, so now we're gonna use a flat head screwdriver. We're gonna remove, we're gonna unscrew the bolt to loosen up the brake lever. This should come out easy. Now we're gonna do the same for the other side. Okay, so now I'm gonna be using a 13 millimeter wrench and I'm gonna loosen up the bolt and I'm gonna remove the handlebars. Okay, so you're going to install the handlebars like this. Then you're going to install one of the brake levers and what you want to do is you want to grasp the handlebar and you want to have enough space for your fist and for the brake lever itself. Then you're going to grab a black marker, you're, you're going to mark it somewhere around here and this is going to be your cutting point. Okay, so now I'm gonna place the handlebars on a flat surface like this and I'm gonna use that measurement that I took earlier and I'm gonna mark it at two inches and three quarters and I'm gonna do the same for the other side and I'm gonna be using this line for my cutting point. Now I'm gonna be using the grinder. Make sure to have a metal disc uninstalled. Disc for cutting metals. Okay, I have installed the handlebars once again, and I'm gonna go ahead and chop the handlebars. Nothing can stop me. I'm all the way up. Now you can level the top 
you can smooth it out by grinding. Now I'm going to do the same on the other side. Okay, so this is the end result. This is what we took out of the bike. So it's not it's not only going to be more comfortable now, but it's also going to be lighter. Okay, when we put on our brake levers, we notice there's a lever right here, an extra lever right here, and this looks pretty bad. So we're gonna go ahead and cut that off as well. We're probably gonna make a mark right here. That's gonna be our cutting point. Now that the brake levers are already installed, uh, we're gonna go ahead and install the uh, handlebar tape. And notice that they are very short, one for each side. And that's because you, you just need enough uh, tape to grasp with your hands. Now you do the same for the other side. Okay, and this is the end result after you finished installing the handlebar tape. This is the way it should look. And notice 
how it fits into your hand a lot better. Now it's going to fit a lot more comfortable and also you're saving some weight off the bike. You can also go ahead and add more tape. You can use a longer tape. But I decided to use a shorter, shorter tape. Just because the hand position is going to be like this all the time. Most of the time. Okay, and that's it. It's a very easy and simple process. Now the bike should feel more comfortable and you're saving some and you're taking some weight off the bicycle. And it's also gonna look cooler.